this summer I, I had gotten a new helmet. I hadn't done a unboxing or review of it because I was pretty busy during the summer, but now that we're in a winter, I can take some time to pause and talk about it. I had gotten a, a Nolan N20, and this is a partial helmet. And one of the reasons why I got this is one, it was a really good deal on it. And I uh, wanted to, um, uh, first time trying one of these and just wanted to have uh, some more airflow into the face. And so far I'm really liking this helmet. And this is not so much a review, but more information for, our, for my channel subscribers. Uh, this helmet is um, out there uh, quite, quite commonly and you can find it in discount houses. Um, I don't do a lot of shopping on eBay, but I, I've seen deals on, on eBay, especially used ones. I believe it's still being made also, and you can find some that have more fanciful designs on them. If, if you, uh, like that sort of thing, uh, probably can, can color match it to your, to your bike. So some things this helmet comes with, um, it's not exactly feature rich, but that's not the point of this helmet. Um, it does have, uh, the traditional lock. And I like that over the D ring and it does come with, unlike a lot that with a strap kind of eats into your chin, this comes with a rubber pad here. And I've liked that. Uh, the shields are changeable. I, I don't know where it is now, but I'd originally gotten it with a clear shield and I had bought the darker smoke shield, uh, cause for summer riding, it cancels out some sun. Uh, I found this helmet, uh, exceptional for people in a partial helmet and you wear glasses but you need your glasses to see and you can't put on goggles because you have to take your glasses off. This provides with your, with your eyewear, some amp, really adequate eye protection. I, I, at this point have had no issues. Um, so a couple areas where this helmet may not work out so well as it's, uh, got no, uh, here's the, here's the picture of the padding inside. It's, it, get, it can get pretty warm up in here. There's no airflow vent in here. Um, so if you're in a really dry, warm climate, uh, this helmet is probably, you take it off, you're probably gonna have a very wet head from, from sweating. So, and if you're in a really high humid tropical environment, it's probably gonna be similar. So this may not be a, a good, good helmet for those, those environments, but, um, I don't know. I don't live in either one. So I have to let you make the determination. I have seen other helmets of this type that, that have a vent here up in front. And for some inquiring, well, it's Nolan. I don't see Nolan up here. This is, they have some that are called the outlaw. I don't know what that means, but they come with this little funky symbol on top. Irrelevant to how the helmet performs, but if, just if you were curious, the, these pop off and from here, then you can easily change out to a, a clear to a darker shield if you need, need it. It doesn't come with a sun visor. And I found the, the smoke shield that is made for it isn't so dark that you can't use it at night. The section that covers your ears over here, I found that to be pretty good for blocking uh, some, some sound and wind noise out. Uh, however, if you put in earplugs, which is the most ideal, this helmet I, I found on my head shape to, to bend and get over the earplugs pretty easily. So if you have need of a partial helmet, there's a lot of great deals out on this model.